Hello. Hi. 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 My name is Karen. What is your name? My name is Indumadi. Hi. Thank you. Meet you. Now, when you come on Cambly, do you practice conversation or do you have a lesson? Yeah, yeah I will uh, practice conversation. Okay. And um, so, do you are you a university student? Uh, no, no. Um, I am a former. Oh, okay. I got, yeah, I am. I'm doing farming works. Oh, okay. And mm. do you have family? Yes. Uh, yeah, I have family. I got married. I have two daughters. Oh, okay. And how old are your daughters? Yeah, my my elder daughter is five years old. And my younger daughter is uh, two years old only. Okay. And then where are you? I live in the United States in Texas. Okay. Now, where do you live? Uh, I live in, uh, I'm from India. I live in Tamil Nadu. Okay, good, good. Have you ever been to uh, mm. Tamil Nadu? Uh, India? No, I've never been to India. The only foreign country I've been to is Japan and Korea. My husband okay, worked okay. in Korea for a little while, so we moved there. Yeah. Okay, I saw your profile. Uh, you teach uh, Max and English. Both, yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, both subjects are difficult for me. Oh. <laughs> because English is a second language for me. Um, <clears throat> and then is a, a difficult subject um i think uh you are uh, but you teach both subjects which is easy for you to teach the students sometimes yes and sometimes no it depends on the student yeah i first started teaching math and then when i lived in korea i volunteered mm-hmm. at my son's school and i helped students learn english And when I came back to the States, my friend told me about teaching English online. And she said, you already volunteered for two years over there. So you might want to do that here. And so I went and got my certification and to teach English also. Okay. And then uh, you teach um, native students and then uh, you teach uh, non-native students. Uh, What is the difference you find? Well, I not much difference. There's not a lot of difference because even um, um, I have two sons and my oldest son, well, neither one of them really like math. I, 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 th- I thought I would at least have one child that liked math, but no. <laughs> and my oldest child, he said, mom, he said, he's taking algebra too. When he started algebra last year, he said, mom, algebra is just like a foreign language. They have all these letters and you have to solve for the letters and all this. And I said, well, I guess that's a way of thinking of it. So I think if students are having trouble with something, I don't think it matters if it's a foreign language or math or science. You know, it's just trying to find the best way to teach each each student. Yeah. Now, how long are, are, do you and your husband farm? Um, yes, uh, my family members all are doing farming works. Okay, and what what is your biggest crop? Mm, uh, I have some uh, mango farms and a coconut farm and then um, jasmine farm. Oh, okay. And then uh, tomato, tomato plants. Oh, okay. Yeah, my, both of my grandfathers were farmers. I had, okay, okay. Yeah, one grandfather, he was... He was first a dairy farmer. He mostly had cows, and then he did some crops. And then he switched over to mostly crops, no cows, you know, after near the... Okay, okay. Yeah, I, I have also, we also have cow. Oh, okay. Yeah, he had, he had several. I don't know. He had probably 10 or 12 that he would use uh, when he was a dairy farmer. But then um, he only kept a few of them later on. And then he specialized in like soybeans and peanuts. It's mostly what mm-hmm. he did. So mm-hmm. now do you mm-hmm. have a, a, a market that you sell all of your fruit and vegetables to? Mm, uh, yes, uh, we sell a uh, factory for um, uh, mangoes. Oh, that's wonderful. Good. 
and then coconuts uh, we sell wholesale oh, okay uh, yeah now do you um, go ahead yeah no problem yeah you go ahead do you ever go to like a farmer's market and sell like the tomatoes or anything like that um yeah yes uh, tomatoes uh, we sell daily oh and okay. uh, one uh, one uh, two days once uh, twice uh, two days once uh, we sell it uh to market yeah uh jasmine plants uh, now only we plant uh, so uh, um after six month uh, after six month only uh, harvesting um jasmine oh okay flask good yeah if i i am a i'm a beginner if i make mistakes means you correct the yes, sentence yes i will mm -hmm. but you're doing very well you're doing very well with your sentences oh uh, thank you now um mm -hmm. did your was did your parents or your husband's parents were they farmers yes okay. yeah so is it just one big family business or Mm, uh, and my parents um are doing. My parents are uh, coconut farm only. Okay. Uh, my 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 um, father-in-law doing uh, tamarind merchant. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. Good. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Mm, yes, I have one brother and one sister. My sister got married. Uh, then my brother uh, working. Uh, working. Okay. What does your brother do? Yeah. Uh, my my brother is an engineer, a civil engineer. Oh, okay. Mm, uh, yeah, he's uh, working in uh, Chennai. Okay. Yeah. Does he have children? Uh, one more time, repeat the sentence. Does your brother have any children? No, no, my my brother is single. Okay. Uh, he's uh, not married. Okay, does your sister have any children? Yes, my sister has one uh, uh, daughter. Okay. I have two daughters. Okay. Now, is her daughter close to the same age as your daughter's? Um, I don't know. My sister, uh, daughter's, um, uh, elder actually, uh, she's 15 years oh, old. Okay. Mm -hmm. So there's a little bit of a my daughter's, uh, yeah. my, uh, my, uh, yeah, I have small daughters, okay. baby daughters. <laughs> now, um, who keeps the kids when you're out farming? Mm, yeah, my elder daughter is, um, helping me. Uh, sometimes, uh, but uh, it's, it's very uh, small, yeah, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah, it's, it's only five years old. Yeah, but I, you know, at that age, they can do, they can still do a little bit. So that's good that they're involved in the farming. Yeah, yeah. I can remember when we would stay with my grandparents, which they lived close to us, we would help. And then mm -hmm. we had a garden all the time when I was growing up. It, it wasn't a big, big garden, but it was for our family. So part of our part of our chores was to go out and make sure there was no weeds um, to pick whatever vegetables were ripe and needed to be picked and things like that. So, yeah, uh, you have some you are, do you have uh, plants, any plants? No, I live in a suburb now in a neighborhood and it's, oh. it's like in a small city um, and mm -hmm. I have a very small yard and I. I teach too much. I don't have enough time to go out and take care of the plants. <laughs> I'm teaching all day and all night. So um, my plants oh, would not okay. do very well. <laughs> How many hours do you teach your daily? Um, sometimes it's between eight or nine. And then some days I may teach 12 hours. So it just depends. <laughs> 12 hours. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, it's great actually. <laughs> yeah, it's a good it's a good job for me because I can stay at home with the I'm here for the kids and I like that because I didn't I have one child that's special needs, so I need to try to be home. Well you teach online only. Online only, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um now did you have 
work from home. <laughs> I know. Sometimes I think I like it working from home, but then sometimes I think, oh, I would like to go out and talk to a grown up. <laughs> you know? Well, here I can. That's why I like Cambly. I can actually talk to adults sometimes. So, but I do teach children on Cambly too. So. Oh, okay, okay. Now, mm-hmm. why are you wanting to learn English? Is it for your business? No, no. Actually, I would um, uh, like uh, uh, teach my daughters. Oh, okay, good, good. Yeah. Now, when they go to when uh, they, they go to school, yeah. First of all, I um, uh, first of all, uh, uh, I'm improving myself. Mm-hmm. So that's only. Yeah, at their age, you could just probably teach them the basic, like the alphabet and the sounds of the different letters. Uh, maybe some basic words like cat, dog, you know, vocabulary would be good for their age. Yeah. Mm. Um, and, and maybe play games with them to do that. Maybe say, okay, you tell me some, let's point out some words or point out, say it in English or something like that. So, yeah. Uh, first of all, I, 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 um, I learned something, I learned new vocabulary. Um, and uh, I learn correct pronunciation. Mm-hmm. Um, good, yeah. good. And how uh, you've been with Cambly a couple of months, haven't you? You've you've oh, been learning you with Cambly a few months, right? Like four months. Yeah, uh, yeah. No, no, no. Almost uh, two okay. months. Good, good. Does your husband uh, know English? Um, my husband speak uh, English uh, uh, very well, but uh, but um, but uh, uh, we speak uh, most of that time. He speak only most of the mm-hmm. time. Uh, our mother yeah, tongue yeah. only. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And it's yeah. good to speak both of them, you know, because that way, your as your children grow up, they'll be able to know two languages. Instead of just one, so yeah. that's with Eng- a lot of mm-hmm. a lot of American children, like my children. My son's just learning Spanish now, so that's the first time mm-hmm. he's and they learn a little bit of Korean from when we lived in Korea. So, uh, but they don't know; they're not well, fluent. Uh, how many languages do you know? Um, I know a little bit of Korean and a little bit of French, and then I'm trying to learn Spanish with my son because we live near Mexico. We live in Texas. So we have a lot of people that speak Spanish in our city. So I think probably we need to learn that one first. <laughs> Since so many people mm, speak Okay. It. Mm, I, uh... All right. I have another reservation coming up. This is the end of our time. So, but you did a okay, really great okay. job today and I wish you the best of luck in everything you're doing. Okay. Thanks so okay. much. I hope to okay, see you. Okay, thank again. you. Bye. Have a Thanks great day. Have... Yeah, then I uh, may I upload this video on YouTube. Sure. Okay. Thanks so thank much. Bye bye. Bye.